All right. Thank you for coming to my channel. I'm Intuitive Empress. Welcome to the table to be served up the spiritual food that is being prepared for you on today. This is a general, general, general message for all signs. This is the what's up with you message. So take what resonates and leave the rest. To my subscribers, thank you so much for your love and support. For every like, every comment, every subscribe, every share. I do apologize for the Zodiac readings. A couple of my signs got hung up and I think I may have to redo those. So I will be doing those during this week. Alright. Please note that if you do the subscribers, if you come to your sign, if you are one of the top three, you will get a bonus for this month. So please keep that in mind. I uh, do appreciate every subscribe. So if you are not a subscriber, please do consider subscribing to the channel. Hit that subscribe button and a bell notification so you are made aware of videos as they become available. Donations are appreciated and welcome on this channel. That information is in the description as well as to book a personal message. That information is in the description. Please do follow those instructions so you are not scammed. All right. Please do visit my Etsy shop where you will get personal lies oracle cards that was created, inspired by the Most High. I do ask that you do like this video if it resonates with you, if you like my vibe, you like the way I deliver the messages to you. To my new viewers, welcome, 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 welcome to the channel. I do appreciate you. So, without any further ado, we are going into the opening prayer and the reading. Father God, Holy Spirit, and your Son, we do ask that you would come into this reading. We welcome you in. We thank you for this day. We ask that you forgive us. And we ask that you would give us forgiving hearts for our benefit. All right. So thank you for what you're doing. We review all demonic activity. We bind and we cast it out. And we rebuke and we reverse every curse of any form, black magic, hoodoo, voodoo, any of that stuff. And we ask that your angels would deliver our blessings without delay and that you, um, and that you would um, protect and provide for us that you would war on our behalf, our heavenly angels, we welcome you in and that you would speak to us i apologize i got a little distracted i had a phone call that's coming in of course it comes in right now while i am doing this message but we are going to get this message out all right holy spirit heavenly angels of the most high god i was looking for that father god what messages do we have what is going on with the community all right so the first card out two cards out was imprisonment and pray so someone is praying because they feel like they are stuck that they are trapped or someone is trying to put them in a mental prison this could have started on friday this is monday so we are coming out of the weekend or this could have happened on sunday where you felt bogged down where you felt weighed down in your mind all right this is your haters trying to do things against you but as the card says your haters make you famous the more they hate on you the more popular you are becoming or you will become all right god is about to send you your soul tribe those people that mesh with you those people that you were supposed to reach and teach and preach too if that is what you do all right this will just be support for some of you and i'm not gonna say just support um some of you may have children or a child may be involved in this situation all right what else do we have holy spirit 
Wow. Okay, so we do have someone who is under spiritual attack. So spirit is telling you to put on your armor, your spiritual armor. This is not a war that you fight with your bare hands, but this is the spiritual war. So the weapons of your warfare are not carnal, but they are mighty through God to the pulling down of strongholds. Okay, so there are strongholds being um, pulled down. People who have unfilled potential are are the ones that are fighting against you. Okay, this could be someone that you hold near and dear to your heart. All right, someone may have had canceled plans over the weekend, or you may have to cancel plans. What I'm also hearing is that the plans that these wicked people have for you have been canceled. Okay, we have that you are an unstoppable force. This is why these plans have been canceled. All right. For some of you, this may be a new conflict. Um, it may be an old one or it could be someone who had um, childhood wounds. We do have a loyalty issue with someone that has a Jezebel spirit. This is all on the bottom of the deck. All right. And this is someone who's doing things against you, waiting for things to happen in your life. All right. Yeah, you have some people that are upset because you are a supportive leader, okay? They have are upset because they want your position. Wow, that's what I heard. Somebody wants your position. Okay, if you like this message so far, please do like this video. And subscribe to the channel if you are not a subscriber. Um, I will be getting back to the love messages and things like that, but um, this channel is for more than just love. Um, it is about your overall spiritual well-being. We are in a time and certain things are happening other than love or that will affect your love life. So I wanted to make sure that we covered that. All right, so what are the messages that Spirit has? Holy Spirit, what messages do you have for the collective community? Hmm. Okay. Yeah, for many of you, you have an inner knowing um, of what's going on. Like your spirit has been telling you, your, your intuition has been telling you and whispering to your soul. You might be having dreams or a thought process may come consistently to your mind regarding this situation and who it is and what you need to do that is spirit speaking to you i can't make this up the next card that came out was spiritual dreams all right so the most high is sending you messages um some of you through your dreams so pay attention and write them down um so you know what is being shared with you and you know what to um, pray and meditate about so you can get clarity. Because not all dreams come with um, an immediate interpretation. All right. Someone is going through a spiritual awakening. All right. You may be getting synchronicities um, in your dreams. Might may be more vivid. Um, you're growing spiritually. And you may be experiencing a sense of deja vu. All right. All right. Again, we have the leadership on the bottom of the deck. You have born leader. You being divinely guided. Your reputation is being cleared. So spirit is saying, just breathe. You have your angels protecting you. So we did have the magic coming out before or the spiritual warfare, but you are protected. This is why I call on the angels mm -hmm. in the beginning of the message. For some of you, you may be going through a career change or starting a business. Trust yourself and keep those healthy boundaries. All right. Wow. Angel numbers are coming out or was mentioned in the spiritual awakening. So we're going to go to the angel numbers for you. Wow. This is beautiful. It may not seem like it with the spiritual warfare, but it is beautiful. Because you have the victory coming out. All right. So we have 777. You are on the ultimate spiritual path. Keep doing what you're doing and tap into your gift. 
All right. We have reconnect to the most high Holy Spirit and the things of God. Revive your personal relationship with the divine. For some of you, this what you're going through is designed for you to connect more fully into the Holy Spirit because your gifts are needed. And we have 999. Your angels are getting you back on track. You will discover and realize your higher purpose. And we have the key words, compassion, tolerance, and humanitarianism. Many of you are here to work with other people and to help people out in this lifetime. Okay, we have 1313. 13. Now is the time to engage in open, honest, in open and honest communication. There is light at the end of the tunnel. Life, abundance, spirituality, and peace are all connected to this. On the bottom of the deck, we have 222, two, two, which is stop worrying. Everything will be as it's meant to work out as it's meant to be. Trust that you are on the right path and you will get assurance and peace. Wow. This is awesome, community. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And we're definitely in a different time, um, a different uh, season um, when it comes to the spiritual things. All right, so we're going to get the final messages. If you like this message... Let me know by liking this video and commenting in the comment section. All right, so it says, you changed your way of thinking to change your life. All right, so some of you have begun to think differently. Okay, when it came to life, you could be someone with the initials of M, N, O, or P. Hmm. Somebody also realized that the grass was not greener on the other side. This could be you. This could be someone that you were dealing with who felt like things would be different. Um, for many of you, if, even if you strayed away from what God wanted for you, you realized the grass wasn't greener. Okay. Seeing things clearly, the spiritual clouds are dissipating. All right, so many of you are starting to see things clearly. All right, to know that your type is someone who is honorable and truthful. So maybe you selected someone in your life um, that looked good, that talked the talk and walked the walk. But talked the talk but didn't walk the walk. There you go. I'm sorry. Um, and you're realizing that you need someone who's honorable. Right now, you are manifesting, so make sure you have your thoughts in alignment and your actions are matching up. Remember, you are not save a hoe or save a player. Some people came because they wanted your help. They wanted you to save them. You could be a Pisces or you could be dealing with a Pisces at this time. This Pisces could be popping up um, in your DMs, in your texts, a phone call out of the blue, or they may even pop up at your door. Okay, but just um, keep on not letting people, places, and things that no longer serve you distract you from your ultimate purpose. The wise will hear and increase learning, and a man of understanding shall obtain wise counsel. So I feel like this is two-pronged. I feel like you are seeking wise counsel so you can increase in learning, and other people are coming to you to get that wise counsel. That's Proverbs 1 and 5. Okay. Ooh, okay. Thank you, Spirit. Holy Spirit. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We could have an Aquarius in a mix, or you could be an Aquarius. It does not have to be. Take what resonates. All right. Eat that meat and don't choke on the bone. And it says, I will not be afraid of ten thousands of people that have set themselves against me round about. Some of you have enemies all around you. That's based on Psalms uh, uh, 3 and 6. You have that divine protection. So even though you walk in dark places, you will fear no evil. Okay? Knowing that God is with you and he comforts you in those times. That's Psalms 23 and 4. Yeah, this person coming in is going to be a fast talker. 
okay? This is someone who is trying to manipulate with words or situations, all right? So be on the lookout for that community. All right, anything else, Holy Spirit, before we wrap this up? Yeah, this person is not saying what they really feel. And when I say that, it's not necessarily love feelings because you could have somebody saying, I love you, I love you, I love you, um, but they hate you. The same people that said, um, Hosanna, Hosanna to Jesus is the same people who turned around and said, crucify him. And I feel like that this is what is going on with you, for some of you. For others of you, you may have someone who does have feelings for you, but they have not been saying it or showing it. And my advice in that, if they're not showing you how they feel about you, then you need to keep moving anyway, okay? Because if somebody is truly loving and caring, they're going to let you know in their words and their actions, okay? All right, so that is the message that I have for you. Whew. Thank you for coming to the table, and I hope to see you at the table for the next meal. Bye.